Tonight, the flu outbreak, an epidemic spreading quickly. The CDC says the epidemic has taken the lives of 20 children nationwide, but this year's strain is also hitting adults. And as 7 Eyewitness News reporter Ed Riley tells us, nursing homes are now raising new concerns. So if you ever develop any symptoms, like a cough, runny nose, you're feeling feverish, you need to let us know. Registered nurse Tanya Stumpo is one of the many employees at Elderwood at Amherst that are now on the lookout for flu symptoms in patients like 92-year-old Hortense Nash. It seems that this is the worst season I think we've had in a while, and I'm concerned, and I'm concerned about the people who are in the streets and places who have, don't have proper care. Some health care facilities across Across the country have completely restricted visitors. Elderwood has not taken that step yet, but visitors who are sick are being asked to stay away, and those who do come to the facility must wash with hand sanitizer. The complications that can result to the flu are far worse um, than not visiting your loved one for that day. The elderly, especially those with chronic illness, are at high risk because the flu can lead to deadly complications. Obviously, our residents are at a higher risk because of their physical abilities, their age, and they have several comorbidities. Staff also have to take extra precautions. Those who have not gotten a flu shot need to wear a special lanyard for identification and a face mask to prevent spreading any germs. So we're in discussion with the Department of Health also. So it's really a group effort. Cleaning has also been increased. And for residents like Hortense Nash, the efforts are appreciated because everyone is very worried about the flu. I've had people say, don't you wish you were home? I said, well, at home I couldn't do anything really. Just to support, to take it myself, keep body clean and so forth. But we're getting those things here. And staff here at Elderwood cannot stress enough how important it is that if you are sick to not come visit anyone at a nursing home because you could be putting the entire facility at risk. In Amherst, Ed Riley, 7 Eyewitness News.